I'm just doing a little bit of prop balancing here tonight. Um, I've never done a tri-blade before, but this is my best attempt at it. I've already done a little sanding on this blade. So, that's not bad. So as long as it's not spinning, it stays in place. That's that's excellent right there. That that props balanced. So that one is good to go. Maybe. That's uh, a little heavy on that one. Well, see, it's showing all right. I think that's just a little heavy on that blade. So, just do a little sanding on it on the underside, underneath the blade. Let's take a little. I got. I'm using 600 grit. A little bit too much plastic here. These are just plastic injected, molded blades. I'm testing these out. I've, I've got the QAV 250 and it's got the dual gem fan uh, 530s, I believe. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to, just for the heck of it, test out some uh, tri blades here and see how that affects it. So that's not bad there. This is uh, using the Dubro uh, prop balancer. That one's pretty much right on now. It took it took sanding on two of the blades uh, here and here, and uh, that blade's balanced now. <clears throat> but uh, these blades come in uh, sets of two, like that. There's a counterclockwise and a clockwise. Her. So stick it through there. And stick this on there. Put the spring on. Put our little washer on to hold the spring in place. And a little tube to compress it. There we go. Now that's way off. Well, it's showing that this blade's way too heavy here. Oh yeah. So the only thing you can really do about that is like I said, just get the sanding paper out. There's a little too much plastic on this one one side. So you just sand a little bit at a time on the underside of the prop. Get some of that excess plastic off. This one acted like it was really way off balance, so probably a considerable amount of plastic has to come off of here. Saying this side's heavy. That's that same one. Still too heavy. Still too heavy. So I mean once you get it balanced, I mean you like you just saw it just it stays perfectly in place once you let go of it. It's balanced. And you test all three positions. I even test in between the blades just to just to see if there's any kind of anything a little, just a little bit off. Because that'll cause a lot of vibration and shake. And that's really, really, really bad on like electronics and sensitive parts. Um, 
any kind of excessive vibration. And it'll present itself sometimes in the form of, uh, if you got a camera mounted on there, it'll look like a, like a, they call it a jello effect. Everything just in the video starts looking warbled. Okay, now that's not real bad. It's coming back to that very same one. Still haven't got enough material off yet. So by no means, even when you buy these things pre-balanced, I mean, you gotta, you gotta check them because, I mean, they can say pre-balanced, but it's, I mean, they get paid so much an hour and they get them as close as I can, throw them in the package. Um, you still want to check it just to make sure that you got a good balance on your props. Well, I don't care who, who says it's pre-balanced. I check it anyhow. It'd be nice if you didn't have to. Hmm. Okay, now that one, now it's going over to this. Looks like we got enough, maybe took off too much material. Okay, that's good. It's going this way, over towards this. Hmm, maybe I need to cut a little bit on this one. That's not bad. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. Good. Hmm. What? Now it's going to this one. For goodness sakes. Huh. Man, I hate it when you gotta do all three of them. I messed up somewhere. Shouldn't ever have to do th all three. That's the first one I've had to do all three. Maybe I took too much material off of one of them. never had to do even on a two two prop I've never had to do both just one I went over on one of them too much I think crud that one's good go on to this one we'll get this really bad is when you find out that the problem is actually in the hub. Hmm. That one's good. That one's good. Yeah, that's good. Right in between. Good. 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 Dang it. Just 
just a little off towards this side. But then, if I put it down like that, it goes to the other side. Well, that's not perfect. But that'll work. All right, and that's how you do a three blade prop balance. So, or a tri-prop. That's it for this. I think I said this video is long enough. All right, we'll catch you on the next project.